All of you may have heard or probably seen cars underwater while on holiday, diving or snorkeling. But do you actually know them and how they work? Let's see 8 interesting facts about coral that you may not know. First, corals are animals. Even though corals may look like a plant, they are actually marine invertebrates, small animals called polyps. Two, they live in symbiosis. All these polyps are living in symbiosis with a single cell algae called zooxanthellae. It is too small to be seen, however, they will help coral to grow and feed. Three, most corals live in shallow water. They will mostly grow and live in shallow water between 22 and 30 degrees Celsius. But we can also find some hard corals and sea fans in deeper water. Four, they feed on zooplankton. They catch zooplankton using their small tentacles. But a lot of them also survive from organic carbon produced by the algae through photosynthesis. Five, corals are related to jellyfish and anemones. They are part of the Entozoa family, which includes sea anemones, and they're also related to jellyfish. Six, corals are only found in 1% of the world's ocean. That's true as they live mostly in shallow tempered waters. However, there is one region with the highest diversity in the world where 76% of all known coral species lives. The region covers Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines, Papua New Guinea, Timor-Leste and the Solomon Islands. This specific area is called the Coral Triangle. Seven, the largest coral reef is found in Australia. It is also known as the Great Barrier Reef. It can be seen from outer space, and it is the world's biggest single structure made by living organism. Eight, they are protecting us. Coral reefs are protecting our coastlines from storms and other natural disasters. Some anti-cancer drugs also used today are coming from coral reefs. Now we all know. Corals that have been around for more than 400 million years are incredible animals. Coral reefs are some of the most important organisms in our ocean. They are often called the rainforest of the sea. They are essential to the environment's stability as well as humanity. And that is why we must ensure their health and protect them.